What's up, guys? I am Angie. And I'm Princess. And this is your art session. For this week, we are going to be making 3D bugs. 3D bugs. So, we, in your, in your paper bags, we are going to be finding this material. So, we're going to have um, four circle cutouts, red cutouts. Yellow oblong shaped construction papers. We're also gonna find 12 um, pieces of um, circle cutouts, color black. You also find a uh, four googly eyes. Strips. And last but not the least, your base would be um, one construction paper, white construction paper. And, also, and since we saved all the goose, we're still going to be needing the goose from your previous projects. So that's us working on our 3D, 3D bugs. <laughs> Hi guys, Princess here. Today we're going to do our 3D bugs. And um, the first thing that we're going to do is our ladybug. So what is the color of ladybug? color red so we're gonna get our four circular cutouts and we'll set this two aside first and then get the first two okay and then we're gonna put glue just like that and stick it like this let it dry also we're gonna do it on the second one like that and put it at the bottom opposite side or whichever side you guys would like but for me I would like opposite sides all right and then right now we're gonna get our other two circular cutouts we're gonna fold it in half like this so it, this will serve as your wing or wings. I will fold the other one. And with this process, the half part will put glue on this. And then stick it in the middle of the circular. gonna come back for that and then I'm gonna do the same on the second one put glue in the middle and then stick it in the middle of the other circular cutout at the bottom also press it a little bit and then let it dry the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna work on um, the base of our other bug okay so we're gonna need all um, our four cutouts again this this time it's the oblong and it's the yellow one so what we're gonna do is we're we're gonna put glue again in the middle and then don't forget your you guys remember the crescent shape crescent shape we are gonna put it um here below below our oblong and finally we're gonna stick it so you guys are supposed to have it like this so this will serve as like your butt for the for the other book we're gonna do the same to the other one crescent shape again the black one and then put it like this and again stick it press
press it a little bit. All right, so after that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our strips. So we have two kinds of strips. It's the big strip and the small strips. Right now, we're gonna get the big strips, okay? So don't get confused. And this will serve as the stripes of your um, bug, the yellow one, okay? So what we're gonna do is put glue on this one. This is a, the big strip, okay? And then stick it in the middle. And then if you will need um, scissors, you know, just to fit it, just to get the right fit, do so. So I'm gonna... So you guys should have three strips. And then put glue. Okay. We're gonna do the same thing on our other book. So now that we're done with this, we're gonna get our other album cut out, this one, and fold it in half. So like this, so you fold it lengthwise. So this looks like a taco now. <laughs> and then put glue under, oh, well, let me change the method first. We're gonna um, put our stripes first on this one so we're not gonna have a hard time when we stick it in okay set this aside. so put glue again stick it in the middle Now, while we're waiting for this to dry so it will not be hard when we fold it, we're gonna work on our other bag, okay? So first, I'm gonna get um, six circles, um, circular cutouts. This will serve as the design for our ladybug. We're just gonna stick it like this. Remember the fold one, you need to open it and stick it in. And don't forget the other side.
is such an easy project for you guys. While we wait for this to dry up, we're gonna get um, the other um, cut out, which we put the stripes in, and we're gonna half the, um, fold this in half. Again. All right, and then we're gonna put glue the bottom, stick it in the middle of the base okay press it like this we're gonna let it dry one more time All right so this was okay so now we're gonna get um our two strips small strip and this will serve as the Until next time. Bye, Bye guys. See y'all soon. Bye.